the next uh, tubular structure is the duodenum or proximal part of the small intestine and its surface is characterized by these smaller folds of mucosa called uh, villi and uh, the layers that we had seen before are present so this layer would be the uh, mucosa here and here's the submucosa, and then the muscularis externa, and the thin outer serosal covering. We can see the serosal thin cellular layer here. The mucosa is uh, composed of the three layers again, the epithelium, and we'll go look at the epithelium and see if its type should be columnar epithelium. So we'll look here and uh, we see uh, the basement membrane here and the nuclei here, these tall, thin columnar cells and between the columnar cells occasionally we see a goblet cell which produces mucus and uh, we go back to a lower power we can see that uh, the next layer is would be the uh, lamina propria and then there's a thin uh, muscularis mucosa in the uh, these uh, at the, these are called uh, uh, glands of uh, libercoons or crypts of libercoons. These are these uh, glandular structures located uh, in the uh, mucosa. And deep to the mucosa, in, in the submucosa, we'll go to lower power and go back and identify our layer again. Here's the submucosa here, and here's the mucosa and the muscularis externa serosa. If we go back to the submucosa, we see glands. And again, those are a, a mucus type producing glands uh, of cuboidal epithelium. And uh, these are characteristic of the duodenum. Uh, those are called uh, Brunner's glands or glands of the submucosa.